Hello everyone, this is Your Majesty Gaming back at it again. And basically what we're going to do is we're starting a new let's play. We're going to do Nexel Cup 36 races, racing difficulty legend. We'll just do diff race length for medium. Unlimited fuel and tires off, damage repair normal, yellow flags are on, so yeah, we're gonna do this. So I've been thinking, mm, maybe I'll be Jeff Gordon. I don't know. I'll either be Dale Jr. or Jeff Gordon, maybe. But I've already been Dale Jr. in NASCAR Thunder 2004, but he is my favorite driver, so you gotta understand. A little bit of obvious bias there, but let's do Wallace. I wouldn't mind being him. I got a lot of his stuff unlocked, so basically this is a let's play we're starting. I'm going to probably either be a Dodge or a Chevy driver more than likely. But there are some Roush drivers I really like in this, so... I know I've been. I know I was Dell Jr. in my last one, but hmm. Uh, I think I'm debating between Dell Jr. or Jeff Gordon. Two drivers I really like. I think I'm gonna be Dell Jr. Just because he's my favorite driver and I've always wanted to run this scheme. I'm going to run this scheme that he ran in the Daytona 500. And I'm just going to be Dale Jr. Let's be Dale Jr. again because obviously he's my favorite driver. I'll change it up in the next one. And maybe I'll help out his DEI, DEI teammates. And yeah, I'll see you guys at the... Uh, you know, next race thingy for Daytona, and uh, I know JC1424 did the whole DEI team thing, but Dale Jr. is my favorite driver, so obviously this is why I chose him. I was thinking about choosing a different one, like Jeff Gordon, I really like Kim, or Rusty, or Kurt, or Matt, but I just want to be Dale Jr., because that's just my choice so yeah it's not I mean it's not really a competition I'm just doing this for fun so this is just a little intro to it and we will film Daytona shortly after alright guys so we qualified 7th but we're going to be doing the Gatorade Duel start off so we're qualified 7th but Starting fourth in the Gatorade duel looks like uh, green flag is out. We're gonna try to get to the inside here, and also earn some points. We're gonna draft with uh, one of my other favorite drivers, Kurt Busch. He was poised to have a good run today at uh, Chicago Land, but just didn't work out that way. And we're in second, so we're already gaining some ground and. I definitely want to block Rusty up here and block Travis Quapple as Penske teammate. And we just need to finish ahead of where we qualified, or at least at. So yeah, Travis Quapple draft us, man. Oh shit, oh shit. Whoa, Travis Quapple got loose there. Alright, so we're going to let Rusty draft us. Hopefully he can help us get to the front. Yeah, Rusty, give me a draft. That's what I want. Kurt Busch has pulled away a bit, about to about a second lead. I don't know how the hell you can do that at Daytona, but oh, turn this. This this game is a bit weird with how just how sensitive everything is. But okay, so we're hanging out in second, so that's that's chill. I'm cool with that. 
I'm content. I mean, I'll start fifth, I think. Or third? Yeah, or no, no, no. No, I'll start. I don't know. It depends on where Kurt Busch started, I guess. Which he. I think he started first, didn't he? I don't know. I guess we'll figure it out. Lap three is seven. Still hanging out in second. Sorry about that. My ear was itching, but. Alright, so. We're racing Junior Scheme that he raced in real life in Daytona in 2005, as you can see. I thought it would be very appropriate to do that, so. Come on, Rusty, give me a push. Give me some speed. That's what I want. Okay. Low, but not too low, because the apron is bad in this game, man. It will kill you. Ooh, don't hit the wall. Alright, we're doing a great job so far. Just gotta keep it up. Not be stupid. Just get a good finish. Points are important. That's what we gotta remember. And I don't know where trucks and those guys are at, but right now I'm gonna focus on running my own race. I'm trying to go for the win. Since we didn't qualify for the pole, we have to worry about us. But where is Truex at? I was just seeing where he was at. He's out in the back, my current favorite active driver. He had a good run today at Chicago Land. He finished fourth, so it's good to see. And I mean, just what a finish. I mean, between Kyle Larson and Kyle Busch, I mean. What an amazing finish. That's just astounding. I mean, that's what NASCAR is all about. Banging and bumping and just hard racing for the win. I mean, whoa. Whoa, yeah, Rusty. Yeah, there you go. Give me a push. That's right. Give me a push. That's what I want. We're, almost, we're catching up to Kurt Busch just a little bit. I want to help out my teammates, but maybe I'll do that near the end of the race or something. I don't know. I want to really focus on getting the win. I mean, that's my main goal here. I want to make sure that Junior gets far ahead enough as to where... Turn, turn, turn. Earn. There you go. Oh, whoa. Car got loose. Holy crap. And that's even with assist. Good God. This game is just... It's so... So sensitive. I mean, you have to be very careful with how you run every track you do in this game, in my experience, but... Okay... I'm going to swap the Truex on the last lap and try to make up some spots for him. Try not to get in any trouble. Whoa. Got out of the way, Ken Trader. We're going to try to make up some spots. I didn't get to get the wall trip, but I think he's a little more ahead of me, so he'll be in good shape. We're going to try to get Truex uh, in the top ten. Maybe pass, maybe ninth. I'm hoping. Whoa. Be smart. Come on. Top 10. Top 10, that's what I want. Come on, Elliot. Whoa. Contact with Brian Vickers. To the line. Are we going to get ninth? Looks like it. All right, we got Truex ninth. Looks like Walter. Where, where did Junior finish? Doesn't tell me. Okay, well, it looks like Junior still finished second. Waltrip starting ninth, and with me helping Truex out, he should be starting 17th. So we'll be starting third, so that's a great starting spot for us. Starting right behind Kurt Busch. Yeah, what a great start for us. Gordon's right by us. Kurt Busch and Jared are the front row. 
And basically, I just want to try to get to the lead as soon as possible. I mean, Dell Jr. is usually good at this track in this game, so maybe once Truex and those guys get up to speed, I'll swap to them and try to gain them some spots. Michael Waltrip's not too far up there, but uh, Travis Quapel trying to get on my inside. We'll draft with Jarrett. Gordon up there giving us a little bit of a draft, but uh, we're gonna we're gonna go low here. We're hanging in third, but we gotta make sure we keep that position. So didn't lose any positions. Kurt Busch got out to the lead. I tried to peek underneath, but I couldn't quite get there. But looks like we built a little bit of a gap between us and Jeff Gordon, and Travis Quapel back there. But we're gonna keep drafting with Jarrett, get some points to unlock some paint schemes, and yeah. No, no, Dale Jarrett, move, get out of the way, out of the way. That's right. All right, let's draft with Kurt Busch. Come on, work with me, Kurt. I want to get to the lead and at least get five bonus points. Where's Truex at, man? All right, we're just seeing where he's at. He's out in the back somewhere, but oh, got to turn. I want to try to get Junior five bonus points, and then I'll swap to Truex for a little bit and. We'll get Waltrip up a few spots, and we'll just do that for fun, just to get my teammates a little bit of help. Oop, low contact between me and Kurt Busch, and uh, yeah, this this race is well in command. So let's go. The guy who needs our help the most. We're gonna wait until they get in the straightaways to do this. All right, we're going to swap the Truex. Holy shit. Holy, what the fuck is Truex's car doing? Good God, it's so much more looser. Oh, whoa, holy shit. Okay. Junior's still the leader. We'll just stick with Truex for a lap. We haven't lost him any spots nor gained him any. Jeff Burton, if you could help me get to the front, that would be great. If you could be of service, that would be much appreciated. Because I need to get up to John Andretti and make up a little bit of ground. Let's try to make up. Yeah, Jeff Burton, give me a little bit of a push. That's what I need, bud. That's what I need. All right, we're going up to, uh, we're going to go up to John Andretti, it looks like. Whoa, let's not hit the wall. Matrix's car is a bit looser. I don't know if it's just, okay, really, really Andretti? All right, so we're up to 19th, and oh, shit, Kurt Busch is the new leader. Looks like people are crashing up here, man. Oh my god. We're gonna we're gonna squeeze by these cars and move up the eighth on the apron, which I was very concerned about. Uh Alright, where's Waltrip? I don't know what happened to Waltrip, man, but Kurt Bush is leading the race right now and I don't like that. Let me just get in this straight away and I'll try to 
get back to junior. All right, so we'll just uh, we'll deal with Wal we'll deal with wall trips sometime a little after the middle of the race, maybe after uh, pit cycles and. Alright, Junior's dropped back to fourth. What the fuck is this shit? Come on. What a joke. Are you kidding me, dude? Really, Junior? You dropped back to fucking fourth? Do you want to win this race? What the fuck, man? Shit. I got you a good lead in everything. Good god. This is ridiculous. Alright, so we're just going to draft with Jeff Gordon and try to get back up there. That's pathetic, man. What the fuck? That's what I get for swapping my car, but... Sheesh. I didn't think you'd drop back this bad. Good lord. Looks like there's a... Two Roush cars up there in the top three. I know Carl and Kurt and those guys. I'm going to try to get the hell past Jeff Gordon and Waltrip. He's back there. And, uh... Alright, let's try to block Gordon a bit. Uh, stay over another lap maybe and we'll swap the wall trip maybe try to get him some spots if we can catch these guys in our lab oh lord I can't believe Junior fell back this bad are you kidding me like seriously <laughs> I had almost a second lead for him, and he falls back this bad. Good God. Like, what were you thinking, man? I'll do anything just to go fast. Who is up there in second? I don't know who it is, but maybe... If I had to make a guess, maybe Ryan Newman. But then again, I don't know. Looks like Ryan Newman from from the view I it looks kinda like Ryan Newman's back bumper, but I'm not for sure on that. We're catching them just a little bit, thanks to Gordon's draft, but... We'll just let Junior pit. <laughs> Probably. I don't really know. Whoop. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, caution's out. Contact between me and uh, Jeff Gordon. Obviously, we're pitting. It was like Carl Edwards is the leader, maybe. Okay, so it doesn't... 
Okay, uh, let's just, yeah, all tires and shit. Alright, let's see what we can make of this. Come out, looks like Edge Newman out for that spot, and we come out of there fourth. Looks like there'll be like nine, eight laps to go. Drop a Gordon a bit, get some hero points going, yada yada. Yeah, when I get in fourth gear, I'm just fucked. Though I mean, the whole field just rapes me. We'll just draft for High Newman. Block four said. Let Kurt Busch draft us on the old high side. Okay, Boris, help me out here. Boris is on my outside. This is some gay shit. Yeah. Well, another caution. No, I do not want to pit. Well, this is lame. Because he's not too far up there. Fuck off, Boris said. Okay, so we're... Whoa, is that Jeff Burton? What happened to him? I don't know what happened to those guys back there. Jeff Burton was slow getting back up. I don't know if Jeff Burton ran out of fuel or what, but... I mean... I feel like this game is biased towards Roush. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. But... Alright, uh, there's a little bit of a gap. Pull the Truex for a bit. Try to make up a few spots with him. We're not successful, but we'll get there, inevitably. And next lap, we'll swap to Michael Waltrip. I haven't had time to really swap to many of the drivers, but we're up to 20th. Not 20th, 12th. 12th. I don't even know how that got in my head, but we're going to try to get Truex to top 10. That's our main goal here. Brian Vickers, you fucked hard. Get out of my no 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 no. Oh, I could feel that car pushing. Okay, Dale Jr. hopefully is maintaining his spot. Michael Waltrip is way back here, but I want to get Truex a top ten. And get Michael Waltrip up there as best as I can, but I want to try to secure Truex a decent top 10 spot. This should secure it well. A junior. Yeah, junior's way up there. In fourth, he should be fine. 
We're gonna swap the wall trip. Try to get a few spots for him. Maybe get him into the top 20 would be nice. And there's some cars over here that's slower. I don't know what's up with that, but get them the hell out of my way. Uh, we're going to drive draft with Gref Biffle, and maybe... Looks like we can only get up to 16th here, but we'll try for it. Looks like we'll be able to do it. Be able to get up to 16th, and, uh, yeah, pretty easily. Everyone up here seems slower for some reason, and we seem much faster, so we're going to be finishing this race with Michael Waltrip's Nap Auto Part Chevrolet. The driver I mainly drive with, Dale Jr., gets fourth. Martin Truex should get a top ten, and we're going to come home 16th with Michael Waltrip and gain him six spots on the last lap, so... And yes, Junior does get 4th, Truex gets 7th, 16th with Walter. We got a little bit of work to do with him, but... Overall, we got Junior 5 bonus points, but Edwards won the race. Gordon 2nd, Newman 3rd, Junior 4th, Jarrett 5th. Kerpa 6th, he led the most laps, I'm pretty sure. As did Carl Edwards. Truex finished 7th. John Andretti 8th, Mackins of 9th, Brian Vickers 10th, Casey Mears 11th, Rusty Wallace 12th, Mark Martin 13th, Ricky Rudd 14th, Boris said 15th, Michael Waltrip 16th, Elliot Sadler 17th, and the rest of the results. Looks like no one fell out of the race. Travis Quapple fell back. He started 7th and finished 42nd. Good lord. But, yeah. Let's, let's take a look at this. Yeah, this is... This happened to JC1424, didn't it? Where... When he swapped to a different driver... It showed him as, you know, Michael Waltrip when he was really driving as Dale Jr. at the time. Yeah, because I think I was driving as Truex at that time when I was battling with Jeff Burton. I could be wrong, but, eh, we'll continue, and you guys should pretty well know the point standings. I shouldn't have to tell you, but, uh, the Chicago Land Race, uh, it was pretty fucking good. Like, honestly, the coverage was so much better. Dale Jr. and Rick Allen and Jeff Burton and Steve Latar and all those guys showed excitement in the booth, passion. And most importantly, they did not miss a fucking green pass for the lead, unlike Fox, which is really annoying. And it was nice not to see... Look, I don't mind Michael Waltrip, and it can be funny sometimes, but other times it's just really stupid to watch. Especially the other drivers are just like, Michael, what the fuck are you doing? They have that look on their face, but I guess that's what makes it interesting. And also, one more thing. I don't like it when Daryl does this. It's this unnecessary. I don't mind it when he says, boogity, 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 let's go racing, boys. Keep it simple like that, but don't do this stupid shit like at Pokemon. He's like, boogity, 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 let's go racing at this tricky triangle, boys. Like, you don't need that, all that. Just just keep it simple. Let's go racing, boys. That's your thing, Daryl. Just keep it simple. Don't try to fix something that ain't broke. That's what's ruined NASCAR in the fucking first place. They thought they needed to implement a new championship thing with the Nextel Cup in 2004, which it wasn't bad. At least you could feel like there was a deserving champion because the best drivers were locked into the top 10 all season. So obviously, I could accept feeling like that a champion was deserved, at least, because it's the best drivers all season. I mean, the 26 races, they've been the best drivers. So at least you could feel like, and it doesn't come down to some bullshit fluke, oh, you have to win to win the championship. You could win 35 out of 36 races and lose the championship. That is absolute bullshit, and I hate that point stand. Point system. Not standings, point system. You guys get the point, but 
I got quite a few new diecasts coming in, and I'm really stoked. I got Dale Sr.'s uh, 1999 primary GM Goodrich Plus Chevy. And I got Tony Stewart's 1999 Habitat for Humanity Home Depot Pontiac. I got a DRI patch, and you know, I got a few other Dale Sr. cars I think I already told you guys about, but. Let me show the point standings real quick before this. Well, you guys know what the point standings is. I shouldn't have to show you, but. This is going to take forever to save. I only got 1 minute and 41 seconds before this. I have to record a new video. Because that's the time length. It's 29 minutes and 5 seconds, I believe. So, probably this thing hurries up and damn saves. But Okay, let's show you guys the standings. Carl Edwards first. You can see it for yourself. My main driver, fourth. Kurt Busch, fifth. Martin Truex. Brian Vickers, tenth. Casey Mears, eleven. I don't know how the hell he had a good run, but okay. We got Michael Waltrip, six spots before the end of the race, so. Yeah, I'm going to be uploading. Uh, you guys should see all of the NASCAR 2004 Let's Play before. I upload this because I'm gonna be uploading this after I upload all of that. So, um, probably I'll record one more race possibly at California and probably call it a night with recording. Don't know if I'll do another game in the m middle of it. I'm not for sure. I'll think about it. You guys can give me a suggestion. I want to do football or Yu-Gi-Oh or Dragon Ball Z or something cool like that. But, anyways, uh. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and uh, I'm going to change my paint scheme to my regular paint scheme, this awesome Dale Earnhardt Inc. Dale Jr. Chevrolet. And we're going to exit, exit season mode, and I'm going to unlock some random paint schemes. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I will see you at California.